TLC's hit series, My 600-Pound Life, features morbidly obese patients as they navigate the difficult and dangerous process of extreme weight loss with the help of pioneering bariatric surgeon Dr. Now. Surgeries that carry this much risk are often difficult for low-income patients to obtain on their own, since the high costs and medical insurance approvals can be challenging to navigate. Luckily for these patients, the surgeries are covered by the show. Contestants who appear on the show are also eligible for cash compensation. According to TV Overmind, contestants receive $1,500 just for showing up, along with a $2,500 payout that enables them to relocate closer to Dr. Now's office in Houston, Texas. It's been maybe seven years since I've gone anywhere in a vehicle that wasn't an ambulance. These payments may not seem like they add up to much, but the overall value offered is a once-in-a-lifetime deal. Multiple studies reveal that morbidly obese people typically pay 42% more for medical care and 77% more for drugs than people of a healthy weight, according to Dr. Arif Ahmad, MD. Many small business insurance plans won't even cover bariatric surgery, so those without this support can foot a bill of up to $20,000 to $30,000, according to the National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases. A gastric bypass surgery commonly costs around $23,000. This means that savings for show participants can total in the tens of thousands, and potentially even higher, when you consider the associated costs beyond bariatric surgery. Beyond bariatric surgery, patients still need to treat additional medical issues that may be ongoing. For example, some patients can experience complications, like internal bleeding or infections, which increase the overall medical cost of hospital stays, according to UPMC. More serious complications like hernia is dilation of the esophagus, or obstruction of the stomach and bowels can even require additional surgeries. As Consumer Health Ratings points out, the average cost of a hospital stay is $13,300 when adjusted for inflation in 2021. While that number refers to the average person, the patients on My 600-Pound Life are anything but average. Pressure ulcers are a common complaint among obese patients and can average more than $26,000 per hospital stay. Extreme complications, such as septicemia, can cost $25,800. If a patient experiences these complications outside of the show's one-year filming window, they may be liable for significant amounts, even with insurance. There's also the cost of outpatient therapy, as many who appear on the show need both physical and mental support. According to Thurvo, physical therapy sessions cost around $125 each before insurance, and mental health therapists may charge as much as $250 an hour, with most sessions costing between $60 and $125. While My 600-Pound Life offers great value and support for extreme weight loss, it can't manage to cover everything. Most patients who experience a change in shape as significant as the contestants on My 600-Pound Life will have extra skin that likely warrants eventual removal. Since this is considered a cosmetic procedure, TV Overmind notes that it's not covered in the appearance contract. The American Society of Plastic Surgeons lists average fees for three common procedures for skin removal. A thigh lift costs $4,863, a tummy tuck costs $5,798, and an upper arm lift costs $4,257. The costs can definitely add up, especially when taking into account the fact that weight loss surgery likely means a whole new wardrobe. As Financial Diet reported, one standard-level dieter did the math on the cost of upgrading her wardrobe after losing only 40 pounds of weight, and she ended up needing to spend over $600. And participants on My 600-Pound Life will lose much more than just 40 pounds. Over 450 pounds. Yes, sir. Almost twice as much as you weighed no. That's right. Can you imagine that? No, it's been crazy. Even with the support from the show, these costs can be prohibitive, but they may help prevent expensive medical issues down the road and avoid hefty prescription costs. So ideally, that would help save money in the long term. If patients on the show do their research and budget carefully, with some luck, they can end up losing weight with minimal monetary loss. Ta -da! Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about your favorite stuff are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.